Hey, what is up everybody? So I just want to give you a quick tour of my Black Series collection that I have so far. I started collecting in June and here it is November, so only five months or so. But this is what I have. And I have these in chronological order in regards to the films or TV series, what have you. So they're in the you know correct timeline for the most part, I think. But we'll just start over here on this shelf. So Darth Nihilus is one of my newer figures. I just got him the other day. Cool looking figure. Some reuse from Maul, but it's okay. Still looks good. And we have Jedi Knight Revan. Really, really nice figure. Now back there in the back, <laughs> Darth Maul, he is a knockoff. Feel free to check out my video on Black Series knockoffs. I got him from Wish.com. It's a great deal, but he wound up being a fake. And I ultimately got my money back for him, so he was free. And so it's a knockoff, but it's a pretty good looking knockoff. Except the lightsaber is a little bit crooked. Now we have the Hascon exclusive clone Captain Rex. I, I actually wound up getting him for free, and I'll tell you that story in a second. Great looking figure. Really, really like that one a lot. Got the heavy battle droid back there. Nice looking figure, but mine would not stand up, so I have him on I have him on the stormtroopers stand because he would not stand up. So yeah, but I do like the figure a lot though. We got Jedi Knight Obi-Wan. Yeah, looks really nice. We have Plo Koon. Beautiful job on the head. We got Kit Fisto, which has some reuse from Obi-Wan from the waist up. And probably the legs too, but still a good looking figure. And I think the same arms maybe. Yeah, a lot of reuse on Kit Fisto, but he is a cool figure though. We have Second Sister Inquisitor in the back there. That's the only one I have for Fallen Order. The rest of them are either hard to find or they're very expensive. So I just have her camped out back there. Now moving on to Solo. So we have the young Lando. We have Dryden Voss in the back there. We have Kira. We have the young Han. We got Val. Got Val at a really good price. The Range Trooper, cool figure, but terrible articulation. But yeah, but I do like the Trooper a lot. So now moving on to Rebels, we have Rebels Ahsoka Tano, which is one of my favorites. They did such a good job on Ahsoka. Really, really nice figure. We got Kanan Jarrus. Got Hera Syndulla. So my Hera which looks fantastic but she was missing the boot holster right out of the box it's a defect from hasbro so i contacted hasbro gave her all the information all the numbers on the bottom of the feet and everything and they determined you know that it, it was in fact theirs and and for my troubles they sent me the hascon exclusive uh, of Rex. Yeah, so that's how I got Rex for free. They gave me that just for the inconvenience of me not getting a boot holster with my Hera. <laughs> so good job, Hasbro. Yeah, you guys made it right. Then back there in the back, we got Zeb. Cool figure. Big figure. We got Chopper. I, I left some of the accessories in the box. I just have him blasting off. Yeah, but you know, he comes with the third wheel and he comes with the extra leg but I just have him you know like this so yeah cool droid and then we got Sabine Wren great looking figure I like Sabine a lot we have Ezra Bridger and I actually swapped out the lightsaber blade with Luke's blade because if you notice, or 
If you remember in Rebels, the lightsaber blades are really thin as far as how they animated them. And this blade is thinner than the one that, you know, that came with him. So I swapped it out. So that's Ezra. And then over here we got Hondo Onaka, Target exclusive. I kind of lucked out getting him. Yeah, really, really nice figure. Super, super cool detail on the face and the the outfit. Just, yeah, I, I, I like Hondo a lot. So moving on, so this starts Rogue One down here. So we got Captain Cassian Andor. We have Cassian in the Edu outfit. And then we got Sergeant Jen Urso, I think. Yeah. Yeah, she's the one that came in the three pack with that one, Cassian and the Death Trooper. So yeah, Sergeant Jen Urso. Stormtrooper Commander, I just kind of stuck him over here in Rogue One. I know it's from a video game, but as far as the timeline of the video game, it's somewhere in here. So, yeah, Stormtrooper Commander. Yeah, cool looking trooper, though. Really like that figure a lot. Then we got Director Krennic in the back. The Death Trooper, which is one of my favorites. Really, really love the Death Trooper. Now, this is the Stormtrooper with the blast accessories and the battle damage. And I left the blast accessories in the box just because they look kind of silly. But so that's that. Got Yab and Luke. We have the Archive X Wing Luke. And again, I pulled the lightsaber blade off, give it to Ezra, so I have the lightsaber hanging there. Then we have the Empire Strikes Back Vader, which is another one of my faves. I really, really like this Vader. It's probably the best Vader yet. And then we have Probe Droid. That was my first figure. That was the very first one. That's what started it all back in June of this year. Uh, we were at Target and I just kind of had, <laughs> took a stroll down the toy aisle and saw that. I was like, well, that looks good. So I picked it up and that's what started it all. Then we got Zuckus, that's my only bounty hunter. The others are so expensive right now. So Zuckus is just camped out there, back there, all by himself. So we have the Mandalorian in his original armor. Cool looking figure. And of course the child. Have an off-world Jawa. Have the Archive Scout Trooper. Great looking figure. And the Mandalorian in the Beskar armor. Great figure, but I had a few gripes as far as the jetpack and also the, the rifle and not pegging into his back very well. You, know, you can see my review on that, but I think overall it's a really, really nice figure. Then we have the new Stormtrooper from the Mandalorian line. Great looking trooper. Great articulation. Yeah. Well done. Then we got Ray, one of the early Rays with the terrible face. So I have her in the back. Got the First Order Snow Trooper. Nice looking trooper. We have the First Order Storm Trooper with the riot control baton back there. We have Island Journey Ray. And I took her, the lightsaber blade out and left it in the box and just had her holding that, sort of recreating what could have been a great scene until it was turned into a gag in The Last Jedi. But pff, Yeah, so that's Island Journey Ray. And we got the BB-8 from the other Ray. I stuck, stuck him up front just because he looks pretty good. That does not look good. So I moved BB-8 to the front. We have Rise of Skywalker Ray, which is a really nice looking Ray. And Dio. Now back there in the back, DJ. I got DJ for free. That's not one that I would have bought. I mean, cool figure, kinda, but man, what a worthless character. Stupid character. So I've got DJ back there in the back. 
Poe Dameron back there. I got him at Ollie's for like $5.99. Mountain Trooper, found him at Target. Really, really nice figure. It's not the best articulation, especially in the arms and shoulders, but it's a good looking trooper. So the two first order jet troopers I found at GameStop on clearance, same day, they were sitting there side by side. They were like 12 bucks or so. So I snagged them both. We have Supreme Leader Kylo Ren. And last but not least, we have the Sith Jet Trooper. Yeah. So that is what I have in just about five months of collecting. And I have more on the way in the mail. Probably won't get them until after the first of the year. Have some pre-orders that I probably won't get until next June. But the collection's growing. In fact, I'll probably make a run to GameStop today and see what they got. But yeah, I just wanted to show y'all what I have so far. If you like stuff like this, hit like and subscribe and hit that little notification bell. I'm really starting to do more and more Black Series videos lately, so I would certainly appreciate it. And uh, if you have any questions, or please comment below. And, and let me know about your collection. What are your wants or some stuff that y'all have pre-ordered? I'd love to know what y'all are up to. But uh, thank you so much for watching, and we will see you guys next time.